are you? How are you? I'm fine. Today are you I sick? messed. Today I messed up my finger. What happened? Did you cut yourself? Yeah. Show me your finger. Yeah. Can't see it. Closer. Closer. Maybe your eyes are going wrong. No, move your eyes a little. Uh, move your finger uh. a little bit closer. Oh, was it hurt? Yeah. Did you cry? No. So what happened? You cut the paper or something? Today I made lanterns at school. Oh, you made a lanterns at school yeah. and. And. And what? And you did cut your finger. Yes, I did. And you have got a runny nose. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm sick. <laughs> And so you, you... today is Ryan's birthday. Whose birthday? Ryan's birthday. Oh, your friend Ryan. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you told me before, yeah. Yeah. Okay, let's get started. Yeah. Okay. Right. In this one, we have to change the verb, the base form to the past simple. So uh -huh. to the past form. For example, in the present, I visit. In the past, I. Is it in the past what? In the present, we visit. In the past, we. We. Visited. Yep. Yeah. Visited. Travel. In the present, we travel. In the past. In the present, we travel. In the past, what do you mean like that? <coughs> Different tenses. Present and the past. Present is travel. The past is. What's to that? Tra mean? Traveled. Past and present. Past and present. Yeah. What What do you do with them? You keep saying that, huh? Present and past. So present to talk about the activities you, that you do every day. Like for example, I go to school every day. The past it means an action that finished in the past. We don't say go. We say went. We don't remember. I, I get it. <laughs> Now in the present, I help. In the past, I. I help. Yep. In the present, I jump. In the past, I jumped. Jumped. In the present, I drop. In the past, I dropped. Like that. Dropped. Yeah. I'm not too bad about that. It's pretty You're not too simple. Bad. You are too tired. You are too tired and um, sick, right? Yeah, I'm very tired. Understood. Now, Now pick one that you like. Well, you can pick one for yourself. <laughs> okay, I'm going to pick. <laughs> It doesn't have anything that like lucky thing like uh, so your finger. Who wish wishes your finger get better soon? So What? I'm gonna pick the. Strawberry, yeah. Strawberry to help my people get well. Now, what are you looking for? Number one. Well, I'm looking for my glasses. How do you spell glasses? Sunglasses. Oh, S U N G L A S S E S. Correct. Yeah, it's correct. Now you you need a favor. Can you ask me? Can you help me to find the basket of apples? How do you spell basket? B a s k e t. Ah, basket. Uh, right. I'm going out for a ride. And you have to give me. Please wear your advice. helmet. When? When riding a bike. I thought you were going to. How do you spell to... helmet? 
L M O I forgot. H H L E Hell H E L yeah. H E L M E T Correct. Okay, uh <laughs> now this one don't Don't jump it's dangerous. How do you spell jump? J U M P. Correct. Here, jump. Do you know why I always mistake helmet? Because I can decide which one is first. Sometimes I Sorry? Can, sometimes I can decide which one is first, which one is second. Of helmet, though the word helmet sometimes makes up a little. Yeah, understand. Yeah, but in case you don't remember, yeah, just like H E L M E T, helmet. Yeah, because I always mix up letter E and letter M. So when you write the story, <coughs> you write stories in your book, right? No, I don't write them. You told me before you you wrote yeah, a story write, up about. Yeah, I write, but I write something else. I don't, they don't have helmet in there. Oh no no, I didn't say about helmet. But like sometimes if you can't remember how to spell the word, what do you do? Uh, you you do you usually use Google or you ask your mom? Use Google. Google. Okay. Here, let's let's watch a video, yeah? Google is my f old friend because <laughs> last time he just said something went wrong. Please try again. Something went wrong. Please try again. Always like that, and so I tired and I, I, I swept him away. Mm. Now let's watch the video, yeah? Okay, fine. Miss Fields lives in the countryside. <laughs> last weekend, she went to the big city to go shopping. She got lost, and she couldn't find the shopping center. Then she saw a boy. He was walking with his dog. Excuse me. Excuse me. Can yes. Me? Can you help me? I am looking for the shopping center. Is it near here? Shopping center? It's on Hilston Street. So yes, it's near here. Can you see the cinema over there? It's behind that cinema. Hmm, I'm looking for the shopping center on 3rd Street. It's between the zoo and a bookshop, I think. Is it that shopping center? 3rd Street? Oh, I see. Then it's not near here, but you can take the bus. I see. Which bus can I take? Please take bus number 10. The bus stop is on Parker Street. Just walk along the street, then turn right. You can see a big park. The bus stop is opposite the park. I see. Thank you. So what is the woman looking for? The woman is looking for the shopping center. And where is that shopping center? Hmm. Oh. It's on... Third. Third Street. Yeah, it's, it can be. Now look at look at a picture and say the words. Yeah. Okay. So we go to this place to buy things such as clothes. Yes, shoes. I know, I know. That's enough. That's enough. That's enough. So what is this? It's a shopping center. How do you spell shopping center? A shopping center. Oh. A S H O P I N G C E N T R E. Right. What is this? A town, right? Yeah, this is a town. How do you spell town? A a town. A T O W N. What is this place? Oh, a countryside. 
How do you spell countryside? T H E C O U N T R Y S E D E I D E I D E. Mm -hmm. What is this place? A bus stop. Can you spell it? B A B U S S O T no S T O P. Correct. What is this place? A zoo. A Can you spell it? O O. What is this place? Number A six? bookshop. I know. I just spelled that. A B O O K S H O P. Correct. So we have, yeah, it's correct. We have many places here. Which one is your favorite place? My favorite place is the shopping center. Why? Because I like shopping. Because I can shop all day. My mother don't like shopping. Your mother doesn't like shopping. She likes staying at home and doing her homework. Her homework or her work? Her homework and her work. Homework? So is she a student? Yes, she is. She is still hey. young. <laughs> She's still young. Okay, Susie. All right. Um, can you make now? Let's practice making sentences with the uh, with new vocabulary. Yeah. Can you make a sentence with uh, a shopping center? Hmm. Like this. You can say there is a shopping center oh, yes. next to yeah. There is a shopping center next to the playground. Excellent. Now the town. There is a town. Mm, do not use the same material. Okay. Be, think, be creative. You can say, oh, there I, are many houses. I know. Many I know. Houses. I go to the town every weekend. Hmm. What about number three? Uh, I... You say it. So how? Oh, so yes. in the. You just uh. gave me an idea. For now, okay. I, I forgot my idea. So in the countryside, it is quiet or or noisy. Oh, yes, I know. In the countryside, there is a lake there. Or you can say, oh, in uh, it is very quiet in the countryside. Also, there are many trees and lake rivers. For example, yeah, a bus yeah. stop. A bus stop. I went to the bus stop yesterday. Mm. To? Why did you I go to the usually, bus stop? I usually, I usually go to the zoo every weekend. Six. I often buy books in the bookshop. Well done. All right. Uh, now. How do you pronounce this one? Into. Out of. Next to. Opposite. Between. Where is the cat? The cat is opposite the basket. So the cat is opposite the basket. What is the police officer doing? <laughs> I thought he was going out. So what? So read the sentence. The police officer is walking into the building, right? Yes. Where is the bookshop? The bookshop is between 
the supermarket and the cinema, right? Mm -hmm. What is the I cashier doing? To, I thought you were going to say yep. Because you always say that. What is the cashier doing? The cashier is ta taking the... Uh, bars? Bars of candies out of the box. What's that for? You know, like in supermarket, <coughs> sometimes they don't have the money to to give you, so they give you uh, a candy or a, a box, uh, a a bar of candy, yeah. So why yeah? should they do that? Because they don't have small money. You can ask your mom why they always gives you candy at the supermarket. You can ask uh, your mom, yeah. Yes. Now, where is the zoo? The zoo. It's the zoo is behind one next to. So how do you think? Do we have behind here? Next to. Yeah, next to the. The playground. Correct. Well done. Yeah. I thought correct. you were going to say yep again, yep again, yep again. Right. You read number one to number three and give me the give teacher the answer number okay, one. Okay. Five, five, five. Fine. You can see lots of sh shops, buildings, people in this place. A town, right? A town, yep. Number two? Number two. You can see lots of farms, fields at this place, but there aren't. There are a uh, few people or shops here. The countryside. You forgot the d at the end. Try again. The countryside. Number three. You can see lots of animals here. The zoo. Great job. Well done. Now, uh, uh, I am blue and you are red. May yeah. I ask you a Where question? Why did you choose the strawberry? You think it will fly into my my mouth so it can make my finger better? Mm hmm Now I'm blue, you are red, yeah? Where oh, are fine. the books? They are next to the computer. Where is Parker <coughs> sorry, Parker School? It's on Third Street. <coughs> Where is the book shop? It's opposite the zoo. Right. You are looking for the zoo. Can you make a question? Where is the zoo? The zoo oh. is behind your back. Is the zoo. Number two. I'm what looking are you looking for? for? I'm looking for the city cinema. Wait, hold on. Wait, oh god. For what? So you, I'm looking for the cities, the city cinema. Now, um, oh, where I know is this. there's there is a play a playground mm -mm. behind the mm -mm. Uh, wrong. Uh, there is a market behind the playground. Okay, number four. What well, do you think about walking along the street? Walking is the walking. Uh, walking walking along the street, oh, like side to side like this. Walking along the Street, Street is fun. Now, uh, where the is the clothes, clothes shop? shop? Is behind the stage. Uh, is behind. Not behind. Between the clothes between shop is between, between the, the the station. And the hospital. Mm. Oh, quite bad. 
because okay. this way there is a wedding ceremony. Sorry. This night I have a cer ceremony, a wedding one. Oh, okay. Right. Uh, I'll ask you the question and you circle the answers. Yeah. Where is the supermarket? It's over there. Can you circle? Fine. Back. I'm looking for the cinema. Huh. What? Ah, here. Hmm. Which cinema? Hmm. I can ask you that because you choose which one. There is a bookshop near my school. A bookshop? Mm -hmm. Are you sure about that? I thought there's a real bookshop at your school. So there is a bookshop near my school and then like... <coughs> a bookshop? Really? <coughs> yeah, <a> bookshop. <coughs> I told you a strawberry fly into my mouth and into my hand. Now let's uh, learn the, the ordinal ordinal numbers, yeah? Ordinal. Okay. Numbers. First one we have. Twenty. Twentieth. Twentieth. Twenty first. 21st, 22nd, 23rd, 24th, 25th, 26th, 27th, 28th, 29th. You forgot the TH sound. 29th, 28th. Okay, 28th. Yeah, don't forget. So, with first, second, and third. Third, fourth, yeah. fifth, sixth, seven, eight, nine. Ninth, yeah. Okay, so which num which number have we got here? Sixty one. How do you spell sixty one? S I X uh, T Y O N E. 61 plus 1 equals 61 61 plus 1 equals I'm very good at that one 62 yeah 61 plus 1 equals 62 yeah. how do you spell 62 s i x t y t you. Happy now? I'm going to think mm -hmm. of you. You're going to say yep. Because you always say Now, that. can you read a story and uh, give teacher the answers? Go. Okay. On Sunday. On Sunday, Charlie went to the square in the city center with his friends. Friend Jim. They wanted to go to wanted to see the clown there. The boys wanted to get there by bus, but they were late, so they rode their bikes to the city center. Charlie rode quite fast, but Jim rode more slowly than Charlie did. Then, then riding by a cinema, Charlie saw a poster about a new movie. Jim tried to call Charlie, but Charlie didn't hear him because it is very noisy on the street. Eh, it was passing Paul. It was very noisy on the street. Jim was very excited and stopped to look at the at that poster about that. Jim wanted to, wanted to ride 
to the city centre. He couldn't see Charlie. He didn't have a phone, phone, so he couldn't call any anyone. He felt lost. Uh, felt lost. Felt lost and worried. Then he saw a woman at a at a bus stop near the cinema. He he talked to to her and asked the way to. The city center. That woman show him the way. Okay, well done. You gave all correct on, or you gave the correct answers, but you just literally just read all the sentences, combine them in one paragraph, and you didn't even stop. So why do we have comma and dot comma. in the sentence? Yeah, I why do we so have them? Yeah, that's why. So. If you read, keep reading like that, and you don't stop, and it's like it hurts your throat, and you, you can't even breathe. So that's why, when you How see the comma know? and the the, the dot, know? stop. Yeah. How now do you let's know? practice. How do I know what? How do I know when I revise my neck will be hurt and my so Because I, I am breathe. a teacher. I'm older than you. Now and keep you reading. Are older than but you didn't have a wife yet. Susie, what? stop arguing. Okay. I'm I'm serious. I'm being serious because I'm giving you the tips how to like read the sentences correctly. Stop arguing. Okay. Number now read the number six, seven, and eight. Then Charlie got to the city center. He couldn't see Jim behind him. He couldn't. He didn't. He what to do so he sat at the square and wait for Jim then Charlie saw uh, what? saw a crowd it means a, a crowd bunch of people a clown everyone was so excited about the clown and they clapped loudly Charlie saw Jill behind the cloud. Jim, I'm here, Charlie said loudly. Charlie, I see you. Come here with me, Jim said and waved at Charlie. So what do you think? When you listen to me and you just stop at the comma and the dot, easier or more difficult? My neck is still hurting. Yeah. No, it's not hurting because if you keep reading in like all like combine all the sentences in one, you don't have time to catch your breath, like you to hold your breath inside. So that's why sometimes you pronounce the words like incorrectly, like didn't see, you just pronounce didn't saw. So yeah, so just, you don't have to read really fast, just pay attention with the ending sound. And what is the best title for the story, Susie? Is Charlie and Jim went to the city center. Huh? Charlie and Jim went to the city center. Why did they go to the city center? To see the clown, silly. And what what happened on the way? So who got lost? Jim got lost. <coughs> yeah. Why did he get lost? Because Charlie wasn't with him. What do you mean wasn't with him? The reason he got lost because he saw a poster, right? And he just stopped. Yeah. And then so forgot the way. Lost. Probably, and did he have a phone? Nope. No, he didn't. So right, he was um, bar. So he talked to a woman and showed him the way. No, the woman did. I, I think the woman showed him the way to yeah, the... Yeah, why would you just turn back and see? 
And where was the woman? The woman is near the. Oh no, the woman is at the bus stop. The woman was because what? the question was where was the woman? The woman was. Now, uh, we going to learn some new vo uh, vocabulary about What's places. That? Yeah. <coughs> now, you go here to buy food. What do they display? Hmm. You supermarket. Go here we go to buy food at the supermarket. You go here to study after you leave school. Like after high school, you have to learn, you have to move to another courses or like way more difficult than high school. I don't know how to read that word. University, yeah? University. When you are 18 years old, yeah, you. Uh, you go here to meal, to eat. A restaurant. You go here to play and have picnic. A park. You sleep here when you are on a, a holiday. A hotel. You can go here to feel better. So you go here to feel better. Hospital. Hospital. You wait here for Station. a train. You I... go here to get some money, yeah, correct? Bank. The bank, uh. You go here to watch a film. Cinema. You go here to look at art. Museum. I heard that. You, you go here to enjoy your drinks and your some snack, cakes. Are you serious again? No, you have to guess. What is this place? A is ca this the cafe? Yeah, the cafe. Oh my okay, God, ready to check the answers? Yep. I knew I would. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see. Now, one this. more activity for you. What's that? Okay, one more. Uh, because I don't have another class so let's spend more time together yeah Ooh, so you can rest even more are you happy with that or you want to finish the class now are you happy about that okay uh where is the library the library, the library here yeah where is the library the bank here, the library here is mean. It is next, next to, to the, the bank. Where <coughs> is the restaurant? <coughs> the restaurant is between the bus station. <coughs> where, where is the family house? It is here. The family oh, house. It here. is between the restaurant and the apartment. Where is the police station? It, it is behind the store. Where is the police station now? Can you see the police station here? The yeah. green one. Uh, it is between the fire, fire station and the post office. Mm. Okay, uh, right, that's all for today. Now, Susie, remember, yeah, when we have, when we are not study, when when we don't uh, we are not study when teacher is like tries to help you and giving you some tips with the speaking or correct your some pronunciation or maybe structures you have to listen okay Bye. Bye. do not argue with the teacher um do yeah but normally when we have small talk we can uh, make jokes yes so next time don't do that okay? okay right after the class what you have to do uh please remember to watch
watch Mova Unit 27, less than four, 48. Where is the shopping center? Ah, okay. Correct? Yeah, well, are I you going... Exhausted. I need to stretch a little. Will you go to school tomorrow? Yep. But you are sick. I still need to go to school. But you still have a duty plan. Nope. Right, see you on Saturday, yeah? Okay, tomorrow I stay at home. <laughs> Get some rest and see you on Saturday. Okay. Goodbye. Hey, bye bye. Good night. Maybe you're lucky because you have no more class. It's Thursday. Also, I'm I'm tired as well. I have a long day. <laughs> yeah. Do you know how many how many classes uh, did I have today? I don't know. Eight classes. Oh my god! I know. So look, look at my face. <laughs> <laughs> I tired. I thought you are going to cut your hair because your hair looks funny a little. Yeah, I'm going to cut my hair tomorrow. Yeah, because it look like. <laughs> Homeless man. <laughs> look, look like a homeless man. <laughs> it looks so funny. Okay, bye, Susie. Bye. See you on Saturday. Bye. You're messing up, you. up your hair. <laughs> bye bye. Bye. Okay, bye. Bring uh, tea and medicine, okay? Okay, bye. Bye. <laughs>